Hello friends and family from Disney Springs. Today I thought it'd be a really fun idea to just to come out, enjoy Disney Springs, and just do a whole shopping tour. We'll just go on multiple stores, check out and see what's new, what's interesting, or what really catches my eye. So let's do a little bit of shopping in a bunch of Disney stores here at Disney Springs. But before we get started, if you would subscribe and click that bell notification so you're aware of future uploads and live streams, we would greatly appreciate it. So right now I'm actually right out in front of the World of Disney store. Definitely one of my favorite stores here at Disney Springs. I did just want to take a moment just to uh, appreciate the Mickey Topiary right here and all of the beautiful flowers that they have lining this entire area. Like this fountain is so tranquil and it's just like awesome just to just have a little reset over here and just enjoy the sounds of just the Mickey Topiary in some water. I will say, like, I don't have any specific plans on stores that I'm going in. I'm just going to kind of pop in them as I go here. I just love to enjoy the sights and sounds here at Disney Springs. Like, look at Rainforest Cafe over there. And, like, literally, you have people wearing, like, long sleeve shirts. I think this morning when I woke up, I want to say it was about 64 degrees. Yeah, so the good weather is definitely coming. It's going to be a great time to come visit Disney Springs or just the theme parks in general. Because it being one of the first stores here, I think we're gonna head on in to Marketplace Co-op first and just check out what's new over here. Like I know they have that whole Disney vault collection and vans going on right now. Maybe we'll check out some of that. Definitely one of my favorite photo ops over here is the 50th anniversary Orange Bird photo op. I love how the 50th is all lit up right there. Like that is really neat. Well, let's head on over here to the vault collection and check out some of the merchandise that they have right now. I think first off, we're going to check out this t-shirt right over here. Oh, look at that. That is really, really nifty. I'm wondering if this is actually a Vans collection, and it is on the front side. It says Walt Disney World. This t-shirt here is $36.99. But as soon as you come in, they kind of have an entire setup here with uh, Disney parks and Vans. They do have the uh, Mickey hat right over here. These are $34.99. It says off the wall on the back. That is really nifty, like a very retro Mickey Mouse right there. And they actually have that same pattern over here in a Disney Parks Vans t-shirt. These are very, very soft. So you have a white one right there and then a navy blue one. They also have that same pattern over here in a hoodie. And it's really cool because on the sleeve right there, it actually says off the wall. Let's also check out some of the pin offerings that they have over here. And look at these. They got Mickey and Minnie. They actually say Walt Disney World on them. They're back scratchers. Whoop, caught it there. Look at that. That is talent. <laughs> these ones here are $19.99 for those ones. Then over here, you have uh, Tencennial limited release pins. These ones are $24.99. Probably one of the coolest ones is right underneath there though. Look at this one here. 15 years Walt Disney World. You got Mickey Mouse right there. And these are limited release again for $19.99. I do also want to show you guys like these patches that they have. So this is like a patch and a pin as well. You got like a retro Mickey. And check out the patch that you get. The Vacation Kingdom of the World. Walt Disney World. These are $19.99 as well. But they really do have some really cool patches. You have Walt Disney World featuring uh, Minnie Mouse, 1971. You also have one right here with Donald Duck and then Goofy. It does look like these are only $9.99 a piece though. That's a pretty darn good deal. I do believe I'm also noticing a new pair of Crocs over here. These are the Orange Bird ones for the 50th anniversary vault celebration. Oh, these are neat. Look at that. They actually say Florida right there on the strap. And then you have Orange Bird on either side. So I'm not seeing the price on these. These are probably somewhere around $69.99 if I had to guess though. They do also have like the windows in here decorated so beautifully with like some faux pumpkins. And then over here is the countdown till Halloween calendar, which is really neat. And then look at these over here. You got the uh, Mickey Mouse pumpkins right here for the votives. Aren't they so cool though? 
Then you have the uh, matching pillows. You get the uh, ghost right there wearing Mickey ears. And then you have the Mickey pumpkin. This is really neat. The attention to detail at Disney. Like I was saying though, for the purpose of today's video, I want to check out a bunch of stores, not just one. So let's continue on our way here. Okay, I think our next stop on our list here is going to be the Disney Parks <laughs> pin trading place. Also, check out the little train that they got going on over here. Like, isn't this really cool? It's actually $3 for one token, $5 for two token, one rider per token. That's a lot of fun for the kids, though. Look at it go. <laughs> Let's head on into uh, the uh, pin trading location. We'll see what new pins that they have in here. I always like to check out some of the limited release pins. Look at this one over here. Look at transformation at twilight. That there is really interesting. Looks like they actually have a couple different offerings for that one. Then over here, like I haven't seen this one before. These Disney Park 2022 Halloween pins. Yeah, they're really neat. Look at this DuckTales one. Looks like it's in an old TV. Yeah, that's so cool. They even have a couple different Bambi offerings over here. Looks like there's four different pins. And then part of the 50th for the uh, Main Street Electrical Parade. They have a pin for that down there. Oh, this Doctor Strange one here definitely catches my eye. Even characters on parade. You got Chip and Dale, Peter Pan. Then over here you have the genie. Looks like Aladdin in the, uh, in the car of the genie actually, which is really interesting. These ones over here are like uh, the old school Star Wars action figures. There's actually quite a few of those pins. Okay, I feel like this is definitely one we're going to have to buy in the very near future. Look at that, friends and family. That's amazing. That's kind of our thing. Disney's taken from us there. But these are $14.99. Then over here, oh wow, this one here is actually really heavy. It looks like you actually can change the box there and create the Disney characters. $44.99 for that one. Also, look at this one here. You have the uh, Seven Dwarves Gooseberry Pie. $24.99 for that one. Yeah, there's a couple different offerings over here actually. Right over here, this one $24.99 with Finding Nemo. So right over here is the what's new section. Let's check out what is new here. Oh, look at this. From over there in Animal Kingdom, they have a Kite Tails pin. This one is $12.99. Then over here, they have Port Orleans French Quarter. $9.99 for that one. Oh boy, look at this. You got Oogie Boogie and Lock, Shock, and Barrel in the bathtub there. These are yellow. I think these ones are $12.99 for yellow, if I'm not mistaken. Got some cool Star Wars ones here. These are $9.99 for those ones. Oh, look at this. I've never seen this before. This one here is Ewok Expedition. And again, yellow. These are probably $12.99. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah, they got some amazing pins here. Look at this. Camp Dagobah with Yoda, $12.99. And definitely if you come to this store, take advantage of the many amazing photo ops that they have. Like right over here, you got Daisy and uh, Donald Duck over there. Look at that though. He's carrying a luggage, which is definitely like overflowing. I love this photo op though. I think next stop on our list over here, we're gonna head on over to Once Upon a Toy. I don't believe I've actually ever been in this store before. And again, they keep on continuing the amazing photo ops over here. On this side, you actually have Buzz Lightyear and check out like the amazing theming of this place. Like, isn't it incredible? All the Tinker Toys, Once Upon a Toy. Yeah, let's head on in to infinity and beyond. So as soon as you come in here, you're actually greeted by a lot of plushies. And it looks like they're actually playing some board games. Look at over here though. You got Forky, it says I'm homemade. Let's check out some of the plushies while we're here. I'm loving this Bolt one. Let's see how much these are. $26.99 and actually has Bolt right there on his name tag. Then over here you got the Big Feet Baby Groot. $29.99. Isn't he adorable though? Like, I love the uh, Bigfoot plushies. Like, they're really neat. Let's check out some of the different plushies that they have over here for the 50th anniversary. Right over here, we have Goofy for $29.99. His whole outfit, though, is really ornate. I love that, though. That's really cool. Then over here, like, I don't get to see these ones too often. They actually come in a pack of two, but you get uh, Chip and Dale for $29.99. You can also check out Pluto. I love his name tag there. It says Pluto, Walt Disney World. Then you got the 50th, and then he has a 50th anniversary dog collar. 
And again, Pluto here is $29.99. Very adorable though. The theming in here is so cool though. Like, look at this, you got some aliens kind of dangling on the track and the track goes all over the place. There's some Legos over here dangling. All different like board game pieces on top of like these hidden Mickeys, which is really interesting. They have a great photo op back here. Disney Pixar Toy Story photo op, which is really neat. Let's check out this selection though. Looks like they have a bunch of classic Disney dolls. These are all $26.99 a piece. You got Snow White right here, Pocahontas. Oh, they even have some different Encanto ones. Oh, Moana. I do want to show you guys what these actually look like out of the box though, because these seem like really, really good quality. Like, check these out. You even got Tinkerbell kind of hanging out back there. But these are $26.99 a piece. You got Princess Aurora, Jasmine, even uh, Rapunzel right here. I also haven't seen these before. These are deluxe accessory kits. So these are $34.99. But these are like very, very attention to detail oriented. Like look at this. Like that is really cool. <laughs> it actually comes inside of a really nice packaging. Right over here you have Cinderella. And then you also have Belle from Beauty and the Beast. It looks like you get the necklace, the earrings. Yeah, these are very, very nifty. Also, check out these Cinderella dresses for the little kiddos. These are three plus. These are $99.99 a piece. But right there, they have Cinderella over here. Look at this one. Isn't that so awesome? You got Snow White, $99.99. And over here, they also have uh, Belle's dress, again, for $99.99. They even have these new Encanto Jaguar plushies before that I haven't seen. These are $22.99, but look at all the patchwork on these. These are really nifty. I like these a lot. Okay, so next stop on our list, let's head on to the Days of Christmas over here. The Disney Days of Christmas. My last visit over here, I did Christmas in July video. Like, that was so much fun to make. Like, this store here is very cool. You kind of get a good mixture between Christmas and Halloween in here. Look at this, the Christmas lights are actually on right now. So right off the bat, you got some plushies that I don't get to see too often. You have Jack Skellington dressed up as Santa Claus for $26.99. Then down here, you also have like a more classic plushie of Jack Skellington. Again, for the same price of $26.99. But he is very, very long in stature. And then right over here, they also have Sally as well for the same price. There's even some Oogie Boogie plushies. You don't get a chance to see too many Oogie Boogie plushies here. $22.99 for Oogie Boogie. They also have these Oogie Boogie ears right here. They're actually lit up. I don't know if you can tell at the moment, but these are orange. I'm not exactly sure like how much an orange item is, but these are really nifty. I don't believe I've seen these before. Oogie Boogie's in the middle of like a spiral there with a lot of different bugs. And then over here, they have some Jack Skellington, which are really neat for uh, winter time. These Jack Skellington uh, beanies right here $24.99 for those. But since we're doing like all of the uh, Nightmare Before Christmas, let's check out some of the ornaments that they have. And again, these are the Disney sketchbook series. I do believe these are hand painted. But right here we have Oogie Boogie. Then we have Jack Skellington over here. These almost look like uh, Jim Shore items, like they're that good in quality. But these are $24.99. These are some really great offerings though. This one here is from Disney's Haunted Mansion. It's the Hatbox Ghost for $26.99. It actually lights up. I bet you the, uh, the Hatbox and the uh, Ghost Face there actually light up. But these are amazing because we're actually getting the Hatbox Ghost over in the uh, Magic Kingdom at the Haunted Mansion attraction. So right over here, Disney is actually getting ready for the holiday season, of course. <laughs> yeah, sometimes I feel like we kind of bypass Halloween, but we have some really nice coffee mugs. These are $19.99, and the handle on there is actually like a candy cane. And check out the other side there. Like, these are really cool. And also, over here, we have some new tumblers dashing through the snow with a bunch of the Disney characters. Actually, this is Walt Lodge's collection. These are $27.99. And also, check out these ginormous bowls that they have right here. Christmas is happier together. Yes, indeed. These are $29.99 and very heavy. Like, this is a really heavy ceramic. Also, for $64.99, they have two, two nutcrackers right here, both I think there's actually one Mickey and one Minnie. 
The one on the bottom says, you make me melt and ski you really soon. They are so cool. Look at them, $64.99. Let's check out these uh, holiday collection Christmas trees, which are actually inside of like a glass dome. These are $39.99. It says, press me. Yeah, we're gonna press them. Let's see, oh boy, look at that. So the tree actually lights up. That is so neat. I love Mickey as Santa Claus there and then Pluto's hanging out down there. That is so nifty. Then over here, I think these are music boxes. These are $29.99. Okay, no they're not, so they actually just light up. But they are really neat though. It looks like it lights up right over here. Seriously though, isn't it so beautiful in here? Like they literally have Christmas lights, Christmas trees, Christmas music going on. Like I love this. If this can't put you in the Christmas spirit, I just don't know. There's even a fireplace over here with 101 Dalmatians. Let's check out what's going on over here though. We all look at that. This again is the uh, sketchbook series, but over here this is the uh, Peter Pan's flight attraction over in the Magic Kingdom. Oh look at that, you got hooked there. These are $29.99. Like these ones are much bigger and quite a bit heavier actually than some of the other ones we've seen. Then over here we have Space Mountain. This one is $29.99, but you can kind of actually see like the inner workings of Space Mountain, which is really neat. And then they even have the Little Mermaid attraction over in Disney's Magic Kingdom. Let's turn that one around. Look at that, that is really, I love that, how you can kind of go from one side and then to the inside of the attraction. It looks like they also have some really fun Haunted Mansion merchandise over here as well, like the Haunted Mansion Spirit Jersey. They do have the Haunted Mansion Madame Leota shirt right here, past, present, and future from regions beyond. These ones are $36.99. And then over here, they do have the uh, Haunted Mansion Kiss the Bride backpack, which is really neat. We saw these not too long ago, I believe at the World of Disney, but these ones here are $49.99. Over here's a couple really great knitted Christmas stockings. You got Mike Wazowski, Soli, and Dumbo. These are all $34.99, but I do believe over here on the other side, they do have a couple different ones. And they do, right over here they have Stitch, Winnie the Pooh, and also Minnie Mouse right over here. It looks like her bow is kind of covering her face where she's playing peekaboo. But aren't these adorable though? Where's Mickey Mouse though? We're definitely missing a Mickey Mouse one. Over here's a really cool mural. You got the genie from Aladdin. He's actually coming out of the lamp over there. And all different like phases of Christmas. He's throwing snowballs, he has mistletoe. The genie right over here is actually dressed up as Santa Claus. He has like antlers, a Christmas wreath, kiss the chef, he's got some gingerbread cookies, and finally over here he's delivering a Christmas present. Again, a couple more Christmas ornaments over here that are pertaining to Disney Parks rides. Over here you got Mission Space, these are $24.99. Then we'll make our way over this way to the Seven Dwarves Mine Train. Look at that, you got, <laughs> isn't that amazing, look at Dopey and he has a bunch of rhinestones around him. You can actually see the ride car coming on down there. These ones here are $24.99. Then over here you got the Seas with Nemo and Friends, actually from over in Epcot for $24.99. But again, these are all like hand painted. These are really cool. I am totally that guy though. Like if Brandy was here with me right now, I'd totally be singing Christmas music in that store. I am totally in the holiday spirit already. I will say this though, the Rainforest Cafe smells absolutely delicious today. And the great photo op over here for the Rainforest Cafe. Like you got the elephants there spitting water, this amazing water feature. I think this leads us on over this way. Over here, all nestled behind this uh, bush to the art of Disney. Let's go check out some really cool Disney statues and artwork. So the good stuff is always behind the case, right? These are deluxe dolls. You have both Mickey and Minnie. It looks like these are $199, but you do get the pair of both Mickey and Minnie. I love how they're dressed though. Those are really cool. And check out down here, this enormous statue. It says pie eye figurine. You got Mickey and Minnie holding hands there. It looks like they both have like Disney park tickets. Believe it or not, that one there is actually only $160. And then down here, look at this one. You got Belle and the Beast, and the Beast actually has the rose behind his back. This is an open edition, it's called. 
That there is $160, and they do have a Jim Shore item over here as well. It's a Beauty and the Beast dome, it's called, for $125. Over here in this case, they have a bunch of Disney designer collection dolls. Look at these. These are $129.99. Looks like they have a Snow White doll. Over here, they have Moana. They also have Rapunzel over here. Like these are really, really ornate. And check out these amazing boxes that you actually get with these. So right here, we actually have the Snow White doll. And if you guys notice, these are limited uh, edition here. Number one of 10,000. Let's check out what these look like. Oh, that's neat. Look at that. That is so cool. I don't think I would take these out of the box though, I'll be honest with you. Ultimate Princess Celebration, Steve Thompson. Yeah, those are so cool. And check out this really dapper 50th anniversary celebration of Mickey Mouse. This statue there is $75 only. Look at that though, he's got like one shiny boot and then one gold boot. That's really cool. Let's check out over here though at some of the different Disney artworks that they have in here. Actually, I'm noticing this really cool Haunted Mansion one that I don't believe I've seen before with the hitchhiking ghost. That there is really, really cool. Limited edition to 99 only, 95 I should say. There's uh, $399 for that one. And it's kind of crazy. We literally just went into the uh, Disney Christmas store. Then they have a Disney Winter Wonderland right here. Limited release. It's actually signed. Number to 395. That's really cool. Signed by the artist. Framed up. That one there is $499. And check out this limited edition dopey right over here. So this is just a canvas print, but it's $199. And they have the gift of life from Geppetto to Pinocchio. These are actually number 18 of 95 and it's signed by the artist and framed. These ones are $399. They have these really cool framed artworks over here from actual Disney movies. This one here is signed by Jody Benson who actually voiced Ariel from The Little Mermaid. That there is $495. Then you have this one that's actually signed by Jody Benson and Pat Carroll from The Little Mermaid. Pat Carroll is the voice of Ursula. That's really incredible, $700 for that one. And this one over here is signed by Paige O'Hara, who actually played Belle for The Voice of Beauty and the Beast for $425. Over here's some of the 50th anniversary figurines that they still have left. And right over here we have um, Tinkerbell, which is incredible, from Peter Pan. It actually plays music, that one is $125. We have this one over here from Small World. These are musical figurines. Then over here we have a 50th anniversary one with Mickey and Minnie hugging it out right there for $150. And we have the uh, bird right over here from the Pirates of the Caribbean attraction for $125. There's another cabinet over here of different Disney princesses. It looks like these are all about $80 or $85 a piece. And the attention to detail on these, look at Pocahontas over there. And uh, Jasmine, over here you got the Little Mermaid, Ariel. These are so beautiful. So they're playing some Aladdin music right now. I figure what perfect time to show this Thomas Kincaid canvas. Look at that though, you got Aladdin and Jasmine over there. You got the genie, that is so beautiful. And again, you have some really cool statues for the Walt Disney World 50th anniversary. Over here is Cinderella's Castle for $199. And over here, they also have Peter Pan's flight for $99. That was such a fun trip here to Disney Springs today. Like I love coming in here and just walking around and enjoying like a bunch of the stores. It, like it's like a different change of pace. Like check out a bunch of stores, all of their newest offerings and kind of incorporate that into one video. Like I saw a bunch of stuff that I've never seen before as well. But if you'd like to further support the channel, please consider checking out our Patreon page. I'll let a link to that in the description box of this video. But if you like today's video, give it a big thumbs up and as always make today awesome